Today we're going to be playing around with the style weight uh, command that we can use with SREF to build up new images and interesting iterations so we can find uh, something that nobody's ever seen before. So I've got a simple prompt I want to throw in here, which is we're just making a circular pattern, okay? But we want to do two different ideas and like kind of combine them. And then we're going to do multiple levels of creativity here. Now, I'm using stuff I've already created in MidJourney. This could be something from your own portfolio or something you found on the internet. It can be anything really. But to use SREF, we just need the copy image URL. That's what's important. Okay. And of course, there's better ways of doing it if everything's coming from MidJourney, but that's not what the lesson here is. So we just type in SREF and paste that in. And we want to get our other image, which is this uh, blanket pattern that I made, right? Same deal. Again, this could be from anywhere, but we want to use the um, the copy image URL to get the pattern. Now, here's where the fun comes in with the uh, image weight. Now, you, for style weight, you can do levels from zero to 1,000 kind of like your stylized command. But what you're telling MidJourney is, hey, only use just a little bit of this or use a lot, depending on how big the number is, right? And of course, you don't have to use the curly brackets and do a whole bunch at one time. You can just do one uh, style uh, weight, right? Just like this, uh, style weight 50, right? And then we could run it. But we want to do a whole bunch of these at once so we're going to use the curly bracket, right? And we're going to do style weight 250, style weight 500, style weight 750, and style weight 1000. And by doing this, right, what's happening is we're going to get 20 different images of this, and maybe we can find one that we really like, and that's the one that we're going to start playing with and doing all kinds of stuff with. So if you're a professional designer, this is how you can get to a really amazing idea much faster. So let's just check this out. And uh, so when you do it, it starts off with the lowest number, right? And then as you go up, it's going to get higher and higher levels, right? Um, so remember, we've got the mandala in a blanket pattern, and we're putting those together. So what did we get? Did we get anything that's really interesting. It's taking, see, it's taking on some of the texture a little bit. The other, you know, the mandal was very clean looking. Um, I think we're getting some good stuff here. And as you can see, as we're going up into our um, style weights, the style weights right here, you can see how the blanket pattern is really influencing this. It's still a mandala, right? but you're getting all of that texture in here that we really didn't get before. Look at that one. Okay. And as we go up, you know, we're seeing, we're seeing this being repeated. Um, and of course we're getting more and more of the influence of the images into each one of these, right? Here's the last one, right? So which of these is your favorite? Um, I don't know. Let's look at them all. I think I really like this one. I just like how that, texture and I, I like I like this one too whoop that one so uh anyway thank you for watching the video i really appreciate it uh be sure to subscribe to the mid-journey experience newsletter for more tips and tricks and how you can use mid-journey better in your uh professional creative work um it's only 12 dollars a month and we publish weekly tons of tips and tricks just like this take care see you